and squad strengths have been analysed by committed fans and neutral observers to the nth degree. A confrontation that all football lovers will revel in, knowing that we might be about to witness a simply unmissable occasion. Oop. And this is how Liverpool start the game. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. And pressing from the front. Salah. Oh, it might be. And that's a very good parry. This to make it 1 0. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Alexis McAllister. Here's Valverde. Determined. To... And having a goal! And now to level the game. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Valverde moving the ball effectively looking for the right moment Gaia can't miss surely and a goal just like that they're back in front Salah has eyes for goal well, the textbook. and that is all for this game anyway it goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool
Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today. The hole in your chest, that's payback. Payback, yeah, you better take that. You could call me selfish, you could have gone. A special atmosphere and a grand occasion. One the players and fans alike have been anticipating in the tension laden days leading up to this fixture. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, I think they have a nice balance to this. Oh, big chance here. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Can he put them in front? Yes, is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. And it's Salah with the cross. And both hands on it. Good go. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, four marks to. And crossed in there. Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. The sound of the referee's whistle. This match is in the history books and it goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. Unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air, and the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high. They vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Good weight on that pass. Can they forge ahead? Vigorous defending. And you've just witnessed. Pumps clear. Superb looking pass. He just needs to stay level headed now. And a goal! One nil it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Nice weight on the pass. They might be able to make it through. Can they extend their lead? And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Has eyes for goal. KB. They could pick out the teammates. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. And the referee blows for full time. This goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. stage that's what we're talking about a match of colossal importance and one that has captured the imagination of anyone with an interest in this great game of football well it's always a great privilege to be coming to you from the home of football we're at Wembley Stadium my name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson and will they be challenging for silverware once again this year Oh, it was a terrible-looking challenge and a big decision for the official here. 
Well, hardly the polish removed from his boots, and he's been expelled. Well, all their plans have just been thrown out the window. That's such a poor challenge. And Liverpool exploiting the space on the flank here. And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Wataru Endo. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Can he find the net? Still possibilities. Oh, did so well to deny him. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. The clearance wasn't decisive. And able to close down the shots. And increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Over it comes. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Mo Salah. And it might be. And the goal comes from who else but Mo Salah. His side nudge in front. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And then Salah's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. But into the keeper's gloves. Oh, he's through here. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? And veering in, and he takes it on! And the referee's whistle, we've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. Now, can he get on the end of this one? Kaya. He'll try his luck here. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Challenge. Dans. And he's through here. And it's in for Liverpool. Is there a way back for the opposition now? Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Well, really that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. It's a good Liverpool move in the making. Can they convert? A oh, strong hand on the ball. It's Arsenal taking on Leicester City. Splendid tackle, and the outcome is a corner here. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Oh, to trim back the lead. Four marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Now can they counter clinically? He's in behind the defence here. Salah laid into the box he's gone and found the net brilliant piece of finishing magnificent goal well here we can see again just how well Alexander-Arnold did to get the cross into such a good area and his movement's so clever once he gets onto it there's only one foot in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal Appear to be in two minds. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Corner awarded to Liverpool.
and deciding to go short with this one and there goes the final whistle the issue is settled in this curtain razor well there are going to be some bigger challenges ahead but they deserve their win today they played well And that is never to be sniffed at as the players applaud the fans. Billy's run is great for those fans as well. Now for the trophy lift. in the tournament finally going head to head what a final we have in store and we are ready to go just about millions of viewers from all around the world are tuning in for the super cup decider my name is derek ray here in the commentary position i'm joined by stuart robson and with the atmosphere building to fever pitch we're inching ever closer to kickoff time it's atletico madrid taking on liverpool well, Derek, this will be interesting. Two of the best teams in Europe come head-to-head -head here. That's up. Encouraging move from Liverpool. Opportunity. Four marks to the keeper. Well, Begins in goal. Joe Gomez plays alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, I think everybody knew what was coming, but he hit it so well, didn't he? Nobody could do anything about it. That's a good goal. Good technique displayed. A chance to whip it in. It's been whipped towards the near post. Oh, and the flag goes up. Ball retention, so important. And he could be in proper trouble here. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're right. Who's going to get on the end of it? And not cleared away properly. Juventus. Middle. And defending as a unit. Well, the supporters think it's on. Palmed away by the keeper. Tackers. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Good work from Liverpool to make sure possession changed hands. On to Jordan. And players waiting at the far post. Still a chance. But no, it's not going to be an opportunity because the flag is up. Jordan. Liverpool in a position of menace. A glorious chance. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and the finish is just as good. A very good tackle. And Liverpool might be able to cash in. Oh, that's a... Can he put it away? Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. And given away by Atletico. Into the final 20 minutes. Real chance. And fine goalkeeping. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating.
Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Now, well, Molina. And Morata's in the vicinity. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, but the finish is far too easy. He doesn't even have to jump. How has he afforded that much space? It's a tidy header, but really poor defending. How can he take them on and beat them? And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Now sending it in and taking care of the situation. Counter-attacking very much an option. Oh, what an opportunity. And in range. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, let's take another look. Yeah, he won't get an easier finish than that. The defending was all over the place, though. final whistle they have earned the right to call themselves super cup victors and you can see what it means to them they really did want to win this trophy good scenes here i think it's fair to say that every single player viewed this as an important trophy yeah, these are nice moments aren't they in terms of being a captain is holding the trophy a lot the Super Cup winners! affixed to one man defenders can't seem to get near him will it be more of the same today Anfield one of the most storied venues anywhere in the football world I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined well the short corner routine no chance perhaps can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done. Cunha. It should be. And a goal. Now they've broken through. 1-0 here. And space on the wing for Liverpool. He has time to play it over. Valverde stopped a certain goal. And he's alone in the middle by the look of things. Oh my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! And Salah! Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner! Amazing scenes here. And the referee blows for full time. This goes down as a Liverpool victory. Yeah, it was a good result. They played well and they're now up and running. That's just what they wanted. in three games the cross is on and pulled back 
And what a magical save it was! Plenty, but now defensive resilience is what's called for. Managed to get it out of there. Well, a victory for Liverpool in the last game against Wolverhampton Wanderers. How do you anticipate it going this time, Stuart? Well, I thought they just about... And the ball is loose! Alexander-Arnold. Well, that's how... Heavy... Good ball over the top. Chance, maybe. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. And he puts it away confidently. Can they convert? And a goal! They've increased their lead, and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. The sound of the referee's whistle, this match is in the history books and it goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well Derek, as we've seen, they're a good team, they've got talented players and they have a decent coach. This should be an excellent season for them. Up to me, fire lighting up the sky Feel the ground shaking underneath, trying to take me a glittering and meaningful occasion and all week long the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams which one will outwit the other in a stadium both packed and passionate so many questions to be answered on a day of destiny ideal weather conditions for football here in west london we're at stamford bridge my name is derek ray and joining me for commentary is stuart robson and we've got premier league action coming right up now how about the short corner? Delivering it into the box. Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. Mo Salah. Morata. And return to Morata. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Making progress. No chance perhaps. He couldn't outwit the keeper. He's driven in the corner. Sterling. Now with Nkunku. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Virgil van Dijk. Jordan. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Could cross it in here. He takes aim. Brilliantly blocked. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. Chelsea struggling to keep the ball. Morata. Well, there's the pullback. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And teammates to play it to. A fine block. Sound piece of goalkeeping. We very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Liverpool facing West Ham United. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium. And oh, Stewart's a chance! Oh, and it goes at long last! Deadlock broken! Will that be the one that gives them the win? Well, let's take another look. It's a really well-timed pass to break the offside line. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Sterling. And here's Chalanoru. He's got to score! In it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Sterling ready. And the ball is loose. And there goes the final whistle. Not what Liverpool fans anywhere wanted to see. It's a defeat for them. Your assessment? Well, they weren't good enough today and really didn't deserve to get anything from the game. I would say they should be slightly concerned with their start to the season.